do you get lost in the city you live in? And I don't mean you took the wrong exit followed by another wrong turn. And mine? I get lost in color. It's the beautiful distractions that surround me. The pink with the orange, the green and the yellow with the blues and the reds that make purple. I mean, all of a sudden you open your eyes and decide to actually see what's in front of you. It's the city reflected on you. The way you speak, the way you act, what you wear, where you go and who you go with. But what about the city? Do you see yourself reflected back? I am Miami, and Miami is me. For years, this beautiful city was just this, black and white, construction surrounded by people I couldn't get myself to trust. They say Miami is the shiniest place with the shadiest people. <laughs> I couldn't help but to agree. When I found myself cornered by the inability to get away, I thought I'd swim with the current instead of against it. Yet, I soon realized that my initial instincts were right. <laughs> we all must seek balance, especially in a city that loves to encourage our extremist behaviors. But I love my city. The good and the bad have taught me so much. And in return, I shall drop my seat and help it figure out its own future, its own identity, its own destiny. As we grow together, we help each other be better. We're all so different, yet, yeah we can't avoid having an impact on each other. A glance, a smirk, a stare, or a simple comment. It's all so powerful, yet we lack the ability of coming together to make a real difference. It starts here, where you live, where you love, where you leave your mark. Which will it be?